I'm with the Rising Sun non Animal Rescue. We have all these bunnies here so far that we had rescued in the back of the shed. Uh, several cats that are, need to be catched throughout the residence. Three dogs, well she's two adult dogs inside the house and um, a puppy that we're aware of inside the house and possibly four more cats. Hopefully no dead animals. Um, on the 13th, the SBCA quarantined the home and they've not been bad. We're hoping to get inside. The state police have been very workable, but we need to get inside the house. Um, a lot of uh, buildup of pneumonia from the um, urine and uh, feces. Uh, the animals are probably going to need uh, vet care. So we're waiting for the okay to go in. How did you find out about it? Um, concerned citizens contacted me and I got the rescue team together. And um, we did not expect all these animals. <laughs> So, um, still need transporters and carriers, and waiting for word to go inside. So, where will you take the animals? Uh, we have a lot of friends right now who have already stepped up, um, wanting to foster. But the concern is vet care. They have been in that home for at least over two weeks now. No electricity, uh, lack of food and water, um, a lot of buildup of urine and feces, high ammonia, and uh, a lot of heat. No ventilation. So do so, you know why the people left? They've been evicted. Their children were taken. Their house has been contaminated. So will you be looking for homes for the animals? Um, yeah, some of them already have been committed to foster and um, permanent homes. So we have a pit bull, um, a German Shepherd puppy, a beagle, a possible two male team cats, two kittens that we're, we're aware of inside the home. God knows what else, because we were not aware of all these bunnies outside and the cats and kittens outside the home. So we just want to get inside. 